with the flood, a lot of houses were completely destroyed. More than half a million are displaced. More than 100 uh, is, uh, are dead already and also more than 460 injuries. Here in Sudan, everything depends on the land and the natural resources. So when something big like this happens, then it will affect the, the food security, it will affect the economical security. It's already affecting our currency. If we are having this destruction under 1.1 degrees, then I think by two degrees we should find another country to live in. Not the communities, not the crops, not the biodiversity of the Sudan, not the coastal zones that we have in the Red Sea. Nothing would be able to survive. We still have time, very little time, but we still have time. So let's do some actions now. We deserve a better future. We deserve a long, healthy life for us and for the coming generations.